In this video, I'm going to give you a brief introduction to the Diffrac EVA and the Crystallography Open Database software um, that's available for download from the XRD Research Facility website on MOL. EVA is a universal software package for evaluating our X-ray diffraction data and it has tools for evaluating peak positions, peak shapes, peak areas in the background uh, and so on. And there are also tools that let us work with patterns and perform searches um, against uh, phase databases. The software comes with uh, the Crystallography Open Database. Uh, this is an open access um, database. You can already access it online for free, um, but with this uh, software it can be built directly into Diffrac EVA. It has over 300,000 entries as of October 2014, but they are looking to grow this quite rapidly to in excess of a million within the next few years. It focuses mainly on small molecule and small to medium sized unit cell crystallographic structures. So, as I say, the software is downloadable from the lab website. If you go onto the uh, site on MOL, on the left hand side here, you'll see this data analysis entry halfway up the menu bar. So, just click on this, and then once that opens, you will see the EVA entry here on the left hand side. So, click on that. And then you have some information at the top, which you can read, um, and it'll give you some information about how to uh, install the software. Um, the second entry here are the installation files. So if you click this, it will download the files to your computer. And you can see a lot of the manuals also here for download as well. So this is what it will look like when you open up the zip file um, that you download from MOL. And you can see two entries here. The Mac OS X entry is just uh, an artifact of me using a Mac, so don't worry about that one. Um, if you double click on the EVA entry, it'll open up uh, EVA here, and you can see this Diffrac EVA application file here. If you double click on this, it will install EVA onto your computer. When you've done that, you can go up to the top entry here, COD, um, Crystallography Open Database. And then in here, there's another installation file, uh, COD for Diffrac EVA. And if you double click that, it will install the Crystallography Open Database onto your computer. It will take about one gigabyte, um, but obviously, if you want to do phase analysis on your own PC, then uh, that's going to be very useful. Uh, and in the documents folder here, you can also see all the PDF files that Brooker provide. And in particular, you can see that we have a tutorial and a user manual file here. And these are very extensive and contain a lot of information about how to use EVA um, for various different types of analysis of diffraction data. So hopefully that's given you an idea um, of how to install the files. Once you come to launch uh, Diffrac EVA for the first time, you will likely find that it gives you an error. Um, it says it can't find the license dongle. Um, if that happens, um, just send me an email at xrd at sheffield.ac.uk and I will uh, email you instructions on how to proceed um, and get it working on your PC.